What is going on, everyone? What is going on? Very excited here to start new game of Demon Souls. What is going on? So we are going to hop into Demon Souls now for a little playthrough. What's going on? So we are going to hop into Demon Souls for some fun. I've been thinking about which class to start with. Um, uh, let me just set my name real quick. Well, actually, let's see. So I had thought about doing maybe a quality build or a strength build, but I actually think I'm going to go OP and just do a uh, sort of mage type build. And so for that, you know, surprisingly, the magician is not the way to start. Um, you do start with some uh, uh, spells early on. However, the royalty class, um, you do start with a ring that regenerates MP over time which can be pretty helpful so that you're not spending your souls on uh, regaining that. And you have a pretty good starting spell. So I am actually going to, let me see. Right, the Temple Knight has a, I believe it's a healing miracle that you start with, um, which is interesting. But I'm most focused on the magic and intelligence stats at first and it's almost twice as high with royalty. The magician does have higher higher stats in, in intelligence and magic, but I think we're going to go with the um, with the royalty starting class. So I'll call it. Royal and then obviously. Royal Gorilla. Starting gift. Hmm. No. Definitely no. No. Hmm. Ah. Providential ring. I think that... I think that starting with a ring is probably a good thing here, so we will do that. Hmm. Let's see. Let him strut. Vocals. I don't. Oh, let's just do this one. Appearance. Let's see. Try not to get too deep on this one. Let's see if I can make it look like a gorilla. Sort of. Um, we're like a, a mash of me and a gorilla. Um, tint. Or I can make it look really crazy. Or making it look really old. Let's make him really old and make him look really fat. Um, hmm. That's fine. Hmm. You can always go down a rabbit hole when you're when you're sort of customizing, but I, I kind of want to make him look weird. In that case, it's like the weirdest. 
Okay. Brow. Let's get make him big. Sure. Color. Maybe not. Yeah, let's make it crazy. Eyes. Let's see what we got here. Weird. Let's make them dark. That's fine. Glow. Whoa. Maybe not too much. Spacing. Heights. Hmm. Yeah, let's make it weird. Depth. Okay, ears. Definitely some like big ones. Let's just see this. Angle. Height. Nose. It's gonna have a big one. Let's see, make it wide. Make it tall. Oh, that made it like pushes it up. I think that's good. <laughs> teeth? Do you even see the teeth? Oh, I mean, you gotta have like fangs, obviously. Let's see, jaw. Really wide, really long cheekbones. Kind of just go maxing out everything. So hair, I want something cool. Pretty stylish. <laughs> um, I feel long hair definitely. cul-de-sac hmm just give him some long hair let's see hmm It's a tough one. I, th I think this one might be the winner. Um, oops, did I not? Where is that one? Okay, facial hair. That looks pretty rad. Let's see, wait, what is this? Oh, mustache. Okay, give him a little, that's pretty rad. Okay. Is this oh like whiskers? Um, kind of like it. Yeah. Color though. Hmm. Guess. I guess having it blonde is pretty funny. Um, I'll just go black. Maybe a little bit. And let's see, decals. Oh, that's pretty crazy looking. Um, how crazy do I want this guy? Whoa. I think I'm gonna do this one. It's pretty cool. Let's see. Hmm. I kind of like that that white one. Oh, I'm gonna do it. Yeah, that's crazy. Oops. And scars. 
guy's scarred up for sure. I think, yeah, okay. I mean, that guy looks crazy. I think I'm gonna go for it. Let's do this. King Alant the Twelfths, by channeling the power of souls, brought unprecedented prosperity to his northern kingdom of Boletaria. That is, until the colorless deep fog swept across the land. Boletaria was cut off from the outside world, and those who dared penetrate the deep fog never returned. But Valifax of the royal twin fangs broke free from the fog and told the world of Boletaria's plight. That the old King Alant had roused the old one, the great beast below the Nexus, from its eternal slumber. And that a colorless fog had swept in, unleashing terrible demons. The demons hunt down men and claim their souls. Those who lose their souls lose also their minds. The mad attack the sane and chaos reigns. Valifax also spoke of the enticing power of the demon souls. Each time a demon claims a human soul, the demon's own soul is invigorated by the life force. And the power of a mature demon soul is beyond human imagination. The legend spread quickly. Mighty warriors lured by the possibilities braved the fissure to breach the accursed land. But none have returned. Pure of the Twin Fangs. Yet the silent chief. Saint Urbane. Skurva the Wanderer. The sixth saint Astria with her knight Gal Vinyut. And Sage Freak the Visionary. The colorless deep fog slowly creeps beyond Boletaria's borders. Humankind faces a slow and steady extinction. The deep fog will eventually swallow all lands near and far. But Boletaria has one final hope. A lone warrior who has braved the baneful fog. Oh, has the land found its savior? Or have the demons found a new slave? Oh, they found a savior. Yes, let's do this. Brave soul who fears not death. I shall guide you to the fissure. So that you may lull the old one back to slumber. Outpost Passage. So let's see what we got here. We got... Rapier. Silver Catalyst. Okay. Um, okay. So we got a little, what looks like a, par a pairing shield. Rapier. And a Catalyst. Silver cornet. Um, oops. Does it say what? Oh. Crown crafted with silver. Um, oh, so it increases uh, maximum uh, MP. Okay. Cool. So we want that. 
I think we just have normal kind of wizard clothes. What do we got here? Fragrant ring slowly restores MP over time. And then, re okay, so this is the one that I got as my starting gift. Nice. Uh, so hopefully that will come in handy with uh, some looting of, of, of things. Ammo, I don't think I have any. Half moon grass. So these are a, this is a healing item and counteract poison. Um, okay. So let's go for this. So we got, okay. So I don't know why my MP is already, so I actually use a spell already maybe. Anyway. Oh, these guys don't stand a chance. Let's do this. I wonder if I could pull off a parry. Yeah, I mean, magic is way OP. I mean, this is just one-shotting people. I don't know if it's only because it's a tutorial area, but... Definitely strong. Oh. So my MP looks like it's really just staying... Oh, okay, it jumped up a little bit. Looks like a trap. Maybe not. So Cressman Grass, another healing item. Okay. Oh, oops, did I just use that? Shoot. Not what I meant to do. Okay. I think I go down here, right? Maybe not. Oh, okay. Come and get some. So these tutorial areas are definitely a hallmark of Souls games, and it's a great it's a great place to sort of learn uh, you know, the moves, uh, and maybe find some, some items. This one isn't so bad so far. Ah. We got our first bonfire. Or archstone. Oh, was I not? Maybe I wasn't supposed to do that yet. Forlorn outpost. Oh, shoot. So not one-shotting this guy. I guess he, he has some armor on him, though, but... Keep thinking there's going to be some kind of a, a trap or something. FromSoft has me paranoid. And then right, right when I let my guard down and I run into a place, there's going to be a trap and it's going to take me out. I'm going to be, I'm going to be going along like, oh, okay, well, maybe there's no traps in here. Oh. oh, okay. 
so OP. Uh oh. Okay, so shoot. Um. Oh, okay. Thought for a second there he was going to be shielding my my magic. Let's go. Ah, oh, I keep hitting that. Shoot. Archer. So I'm getting, I got a soul item, some a healing item. I think it's about time for a boss fight. Let's see what we got here. Try this thing. Let's see the rapier. All right. Yep. Oh. Later. Some more healing items. You know, I'm going to. We do this. I'm going to put the weaker healing item first. Just it's really up to you how you organize your inventory, obviously, but I'm gonna just do that. This is the boss fight. Let's see. Oh, okay. Creepy noises, that's for sure. Okay. Definitely have a lot of healing items, which is nice. So. Like, oh, okay. This has got to be the boss. Let's see. I got my healing items. And my MP is pretty low. Well, we'll see. Let's do this. Oh my god. So my strategy is to try to stay close, um, to try to roll when when it attacks, try to get, stay in its back. So far, so good. Oh, he, <laughs> I should have said that. Uh, oh. Oh. Oh, I'm dead. Wow. Okay. Not that not that bad though. I think I did Oh. Okay. Well, so I guess you get one shot at that. Quit the Nexus. 
but the five archstones will guide thee to the outer lands. All right, so we are in the Nexus. So these guys, let's see. Oh, you slipped through the fissure too, did you? You came for demon souls, or to save this land and be remembered as a hero. Hunting for demons? Try one of the archstones. Now go. That is why you came, is it not? To this accursed Voluntaria? This is most definitely why I came. Mm, you knew here. Are you here for my services? The name's Baldwin. Just an ordinary blacksmith. It's simple. Just bring me all the souls you can. In trade, I'll give you weapons. Or forge the ones you already have. With your souls, I can eke out a living. And with my weapons, you can go on living. Not a bad deal, eh? No interest, eh? Okay, so 